Yeah, yeah, real quick the, on the mic. Uh, how does it feel, uh, uh, not just to get this, but to uh, be able uh, physically to be a part of it? Because there were a couple times this year when uh, I know you had some tough, t uh, a tough time staying healthy. Uh, it's a great feeling to be back with my team. And everyone worked so hard, and when I was out, Bradley stepped up and did a great job. And it's a great, it's a great thing to be a part of this. Graham, Graham could you explain? Because you know you're gonna get what happened when went through my head on that time. Well, uh, first thing I noticed when after I was done blocking my guy, I saw the ball just in the air, and I saw it basically rolling behind the line of scrimmage. And I talked over to go down it, make sure it didn't go any farther back. And I picked the ball up, and I was going to just go walk it over to the ref, but I heard Coach Capretta from the sideline deal run. And I just took off running and didn't hear a whistle. Next thing I knew, I was tackled by my own teammates in the end of it. So, yeah. Were you aware of that rule before, or did, did you know that was a live ball at all? Um, I, I wasn't thinking that during the play. I, uh, I was not aware of that rule, but it, it does make sense to me after, after it happens. <laughs> Nico, could you talk about this defense? Um, and what was the key? Was it just a case you physically beat them up front today? I mean, you had a lot of tackles yourself. But uh, is this defense really kind of peaking right now? Uh, no, we haven't. I don't think we played our best ball yet. Um, Coach Fleming, he instills a tenacity in us, you know, a will that we don't stop until the whistle. Everybody's hunting the ball every play, you know, and we've